Off the top at six, we're staying on top of breaking news out of Northwest DC. A 17 year old student is shot and killed following a fight in a parking lot at Roosevelt High School. Fox 5's Tisha Lewis joins us now live. Tisha, at this point, are police revealing anything about all the surveillance video that they said that they have on this? Yeah, so what's interesting about this case is that you uh, are correct, Angie and Shamari. There is surveillance video, and apparently the incident was captured on surveillance video, even though we're told that some of it was obstructed in terms of an object. But what we do know is that police say that this started as some type of altercation, and then there were shots fired. You can see behind me still an active scene hours after the incident. Now, police are reviewing that surveillance video as we speak. They say there are several people potential witnesses in that surveillance video. They're hoping to hear from anyone who was on scene, on site, and may have saw exactly what happened. What we do know is that a teenage boy was pronounced dead at a nearby hospital after being fatally shot. Police say he is a student at Roosevelt High School. Several schools, including Roosevelt, were placed on lockdown. Those lockdowns, of course, have since been lifted. Students have been dismissed. Police also say they have found the green BMW and driver they were searching for, though they are unwilling to say if they are connected to this case. They're still investigating. The shooting happened around 2.30 this afternoon while school was in session. Dozens upon dozens of police officers responded and remain on the scene. We're told the victim's family was also on the scene at some point speaking with police. What we are asking is because there were other people on the scene, if you've seen anything, saw anything, Please call us at 50411. You can text us anonymously, or you can call us on 202 727 9099. We actually really need to hear from those people that were on this scene today so that we can bring justice to this family that lost their loved one today. Police have identified the victim, but they are not releasing his identity. They are turning to the public, making a pretty heavy push to the public to come forward if they know anything about what may have happened. They're asking anyone who saw something to say something and call police. Again, the victim was taken to the hospital, pronounced dead. A gun was recovered from the scene. And right now, Mayor Muriel Bowser is also in the neighborhood, meeting with residents who obviously have some concerns about what took place in a parking lot here at Roosevelt High School. She is urging, uh, you know, residents that they are, the district is doing its best that they can to keep everyone safe. Obviously, a lot of parents as well have some concerns as well. Back to you.